Ellie. Ellie. What, PJ? You look like a caged tiger. What? You look like a tiger pacing around in a cage. What's wrong? Oh, I guess I'm impatient. The mailman should have been here 10 minutes ago. Oh, just calm down. He'll be here soon. Be patient. Patient? PJ, my order should have been here days ago. Ellie, you see this calculator I'm working on? Yes. This is helping me be patient. <laughs> Maybe you just need a project of your own on which to exercise your patience. I have one. Oh, you do? Waiting for the mailman. <laughs> oh, there he is. <sighs> Here it is, here it is. Oh, I see your package came. Do you feel better now? Well, let's see what's in here first. Oh, no. Now what's wrong? I ordered cologne. What do I get? Soap. So? So? PJ, I needed that cologne. <laughs> well, you just have to reorder it, I guess. PJ, that would take two more weeks. Patience. Remember, Ellie, patience! I know, I know. Hi, PJ. Hi, PJ. Hi, everybody. What are you working on, PJ? Yeah. Well, I'm working on my patience. What? <laughs> well, actually, I'm working on this calculator, but it's taking me so long, and I'm having to be so careful that it helps me be more patient, you see? If you're a patient person, you stay relaxed, and you can wait calmly in case you should ever have to. <laughs> Do you think that you're a patient person, PJ? Yeah, I think I'm pretty patient. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I've been working on this a long time, and I still feel relaxed. <laughs> Hi, everybody. Hi. What's Hi. wrong, Ellie? Yeah, you're not your usual cheerful self. What's wrong? I guess I need to learn some patience. I've been waiting on my cologne for two weeks. <laughs> She's been waiting and waiting and waiting for that cologne, and now the package finally arrives and there's soap in it. Oh. <laughs> That's too bad. Yep. Yeah. Well, I know what I need. A big dose of the Sunshine Factory. Maybe I'll learn some patience there. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, boy, this will be fun. Oh, no, no. Would you hurry up? I want to get to the boiler room. Why are you so impatient, Crabtree? Smudge has almost completed hay by a stack up. <laughs> I want to get out of here before PJ comes in. If he sees me, he'll give me more work. Well, am I healthy, Dr. Smudge? Uh-huh. Let's go get your health certificate. Health certificate? Oh, boy, let's go. <laughs> Hi, everybody. Oh, Crabtree. <laughs> I'm glad you're here. Oh, uh, PJ, you see, I have some work. I have to No, do. I hold do. on. It'll just take a moment. What? I... <laughs> Ellie, will you jump rope with us in the game room? Oh, sure. Yeah. I'd love to. Let's go. I used to jump rope and ask Well, kids. PJ, what is it? Well, <laughs> as a matter of fact, I uh, have a few items here that need repairing today. Oh, wonderful. <laughs> Goodbye. Well, I've never seen Crabtree so impatient to get to work. I don't think Crabtree was impatient to begin his work. He was afraid you'd give him more if he stayed around. Oh, yeah, I should have guessed. <laughs> now, I never did know Crabtree to be impatient to get to work. Oh. Penelope? Penelope? Oh, I'm late for work myself. I hope Penelope's ready. Penelope? Oh, I'm a bit. Oh. What did you say? Oh, dear. I really need to practice more patience. Penelope? Okay. I'm ready to go, Clarence. Oh, good. We're quite late already. Let's go. Oh, wait a minute. I forgot my hat. I'll be back to Jiffy. Well, hurry. Hurry! Okay, I'm ready to roll. No! Hold your horses. I forgot to turn off my makeup mirror. I'll be right back. Penelope, 
We'll never make it. Have patience, Clarence, old boy. Okay. Meet you there. Uh, wait, Penelope. Have you forgotten anything at all? Well, I don't think so. I've got my necklace on and touched up my lipstick. Yeah, I think that's it. I'm glad, Penelope. I was about to lose my patience. Lose? Lose? Oh, Clarence, I lost my hat. Where'd I put the thing? I'll be right back. Penelope, I give up. Why is it PJ has to give me the difficult appliances to fix? I don't know. If I turn the gear to the right, it runs too fast. Too fast. If I turn the gear to the left, the alarm rings constantly. I can't wait. Oh, I give up. Oh! Oh, temper tantrum. No, Smudge, I did not throw a temper tantrum. I'm just tired of fixing old appliances. You out? Am I out of what? Out of patience. Out of pa I suppose I am out of patience. So what? Well, I have a present for you. You have a present? For me? Wait right there. Oh, goody, I just love presents. Oh, here, here it is. It, it, Smudge, this, this is my present. Uh-huh. It's a box of knotted up kite string. Will it give you patience? This will give me patience? Uh-huh. How? You straighten it out. You expect me to straighten out the knots and tangles in this kite string? Uh huh, and you'll get patient. And I'll get patient. You'll get patient. I don't know. And then I'll help you fix the clock. And then you'll help me fix the clock? Uh huh. Oh, all right. Smudge, this is impossible! Oh. <laughs> and finish your book, Hey, I want to see what's on the factory finder today. Oh, no, I'm almost finished. Oh, hey, why I've been waiting and waiting. Okay, I'm finished. <laughs> now I'm going to turn the factory finder. Maybe it will be a little patient. wrong, Penelope? Is something wrong? I should say so. I can't learn to type, Clarence. I keep getting my A's mixed up with my O's, and then my toes get caught between the keys. Oh, I give up. Penelope, it takes patience to learn how to type. Patience and practice. Patience and practice. Patience and practice. Huh. Practice won't help me until I learn my letters. I don't know a B from a P or an M from an M. Huh. Are you ready to learn your letters? Well, it couldn't hurt. Let's get started. Okay, look at these flashcards. Hmm. What's the first letter? 
Penelope, say O. The first letter is O. O! Oh, 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 o! Oh. Okay, Claire. Good! O! Oh. Good, Penelope. Now, this is a Q. No, that's an O with a dirty spot on it. Hmm, let me get a rag and wipe that off. No, Penelope. What? It's not a spot. It's the letter Q. Say Q, Penelope. Say Q. Thank you, Clarence. Patience and practice. Patience and practice. <laughs> no, Penelope. Say the letter Q. Let me clean up that old Clarence. I give up. Oh, thank you, Clarence. Thank you. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I know. Yeah. I was crying. I was crying. Oh, hi, kids. Oh, hi, Peter. Hi, Peter. Hey, it's time for your nap. Nap? Yeah. I wanted to play. <laughs> I'm just teasing. Oh. Come here. I want to show you something. Look what I've got today. What are they? It's what I call stackables. Stackables? Yeah, we're going to stack them. Who wants to go first? I do. Okay, good. Ben, you go next. Okay. Put that one there. Put that one there. One more. One. Oh. Uh, that's not going to work. That Try again. Work. Let me see. Hmm. Just be careful. Let me see. That one there. Yeah, this is going to work. Uh, Bounce. Go. Uh -oh. <laughs> Now, wait a minute. That's the whole purpose of this exercise. See? We have to show patience and cooperation. Why didn't I think of that? Now, we'll just be very careful and be patient. No. And no. Show, no, that's and that's show cooperation. We can make it work. Whoa, now be careful. How you let you talk me into this? Smudge, oh, grow patience indeed. Well, I think oh, the only thing that's growing with me right now is this web of string all around me. Well, I'm fixing the clock. Fixing the clock? That's the least you could do after getting me into this mess. Why don't you untangle the string, crab tree, and then you'll grow more patience. Well, what? Is it working? Is it working? Does it look like it's working? I'm not growing patient smudge. I'm growing a web of string around me. I'm growing more irritable. Well, oh. PJ says patient makes particular problem possible. Oh, that's easy for him to say. Hello, everybody. Hello, Haywire. That's a crab tree. Are you playing some kind of strange game? Does it look like I'm playing a game? No, I'm not playing a game. Is this a costume? Oh, I know. You're pretending to be a tennis net. Oh, I am not trying to be a tennis net, Haywire. I'm trying to get out of the string. Oh, dear. Well, I came. Let me see. Why did I come here? Oh, yes. I came because Ellie said to come up and take her homemade training. Oh, goody, homemade pralines. I love homemade pralines. Well, what, what smudge weight? I like pralines, too. Oh, I can't get untangled. That's great. I'll tell Ellie you're all tied up learning patience. What? I, it's a... What? Smudge, come back and help me. This makes me so mad. Move the chair a little bit farther forward there. I can't get this screw tightened here. Grandpa, oh. do you ever get impatient? <sighs> Lots of times. I get impatient when I'm in a hurry and I have to wait in the line at school. Or when I'm painting something and I have to wait for it to dry. Or when a screw won't tighten. <laughs> yes, or like when a screw won't tighten. Exactly. Sometimes I just have to simmer down. <laughs> Remember to be patient. <laughs> I have to stop and wait and look for the right time. And while I'm waiting, I remember that God is looking out for the best for me. <laughs> stop, wait, look and see. 
Stop, wait, what will be, will be. <laughs> you see, Psalm 37 in the Bible tells us to rest in the Lord and wait patiently for Him and don't fret. Patience is part of living and we must stop and wait and look and see what will be for the right time, the right place, the right way, the right day. Patiently wait and see what will be, will be. And we must stop and wait and look and see what will be for the right time, the right way, the right place, the right day. Patiently wait and see what will be, will be. <laughs> the city library. It's for a book report that's due in three days, and I've got to hurry. <laughs> oh, boy. No, oh, I can't do anything with this book. Well, now, wait a minute. What did we learn today? Oh, have patience. Yeah, let me find the number for you. In fact, why don't you just let me make the call for you? Okay. I have a way of handling people over the phone. What's the name of the book you're looking for? Um, Green Apples, Red Apples by Becky Berry. Okay. Hello? Yes, I'm looking for a certain book there at the library. Could... <laughs> they didn't let me finish. <laughs> she said, would you hold, please? <laughs> <laughs> uh, yes, thank you. Uh, I'm trying to find out if you have a certain book at the library. It's called Green Apples, Red Apples by Becky Berry. Yeah, what I... <laughs> Can't believe this. <laughs> she put me on hold again. <laughs> Stand to be put on hold. <laughs> it drives me crazy to be put on hold. DJ, remember to be patient. Mm. 